diamonds here tonight and the millions watching around the world. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, let's get ready to rumble! The chant of MVP for Carmen on right from the start, although that can do funny things in the opposite way because it could also fire up number 23, Michael Jordan. Well, Michael has said from the very beginning of this so-called controversy that it didn't bother him. Good luck to Carl Malone. He deserved it. But Michael Jordan does not like to come in second in anything. Who has been an unsung hero for Chicago. Able to control. Dennis Rodman with a new look. And Jordan being played by Brown. Fires over him for three. Not a single dribble on that entire possession. Everybody touched it. Jordan beats the shot clock for the three. And for a sec for Carl Malone, putting moves on Luke Block. During the regular season, Utah 38 and 3 here at Delta Center. Second best home record in the NBA. Again, the room. For Jordan. All set up by Scotty Pippen going to the mismatch inside against Hornacek. Drew the defense and then they leave Jordan alone. That's his. Pippen for three. Yes. Get Carl Malone down low. The Jazz have not had anything in the basket other than Russell's broken play. Hornacek able to hit, although Pippen got a piece of it. Ball. <laughs> Malone again. For that block, the guards have got a block on the Continues to play perfect ball. Matt Dukas, Bob Rashad, and Jim Gray. And here's Jordan. Got the step and was hit hard in DC. Well, we talked at the outset about the Jazz needing to get running the floor. Final balls. <laughs> Biggest lead of the game. For Utah, they are up by 13. Kerr for three. On tobacco. Oh. Finally, they settled on a new skin, which seems to be holding up very well. Mark? Yes, wise move passing <laughs> on that particular suggestion. And Michael Jordan with his first field goal since the opening minutes of the game. And the first... Well, Phil Jackson and the Bulls are waiting for Dennis Rodman to get more involved in some way. Jordan, it counts, and the foul. So, four remaining in this first half. Here's the move by Jordan, and the foul committed by Malone. It's the taking a contribution, but the only starter for Chicago doing anything of note, Michael Jordan. And he just boy did a terrific defensive job on Jordan, forcing him away, take a tough shot. And Longley stretched by Malone. Foster on the open floor, able to put it behind his back. Again, they are on their feet here in Salt Lake City. It's a 15-point Utah lead, and they're looking for more. They double up on Stockton. Foster for three. Yes! The alley oop for Jordan. <laughs> like a true center. <laughs> Look at him get to the hoop. This is up the outside shot. Gets that little bit of seam. Not to be denied tonight. Michael Jordan so frustrated. What's going on out here? He's asking himself. Well, he didn't want to come out of the game. Four minutes to go in the half. His team's struggling as Pippen gets one. <laughs> Pippen again for three. Wow, catch that ball. Nice pass from Kirko. It counts in the foul. Ten on the 24. Alone. Beautiful shovel for Stockton. Kirko Jordan quiet with 14. Had a storm. And the Prudential halftime report right after these words. Tag able to finish.
But notice how Ostertag is Ryan Williams and Foster strong in reserve. Foster. They are one. The long over Jordan. Now to five. Team from the field in the final medicine to miss their last nine shots. Here's Jordan. Oh, what a move. Getting it over the outstretched arm of Greg Foster. So Chicago has reeled off nine unanswered. Just under eight minutes to go in the fourth. Jordan. And the tip by Brian Williams. Able to hit. He has 31. And the Jazz lead. 69 with just under six minutes remaining in the four. Jordan for three. Yes. Bulls defense falling apart. Utah by 14. Jordan stopped by Russell. Able to shoot over him. Michael Jordan with 23. It's the Jazz 86 and the Bulls 74. Time running out. The Bulls. We approach four minutes to go in this fourth quarter. They are down by 14. Jordan for three. Yes. <laughs> He's too good. He has fourth quarter. He has scored the last eight for Chicago in a variety of ways, breaking the defense down in the lane. He's hit two three pointers. Stopping on a dime, pulling up for the jump shot one more time with the three-point shot. And this is not anything strange to Michael Jordan. Game two against the Washington having a big fourth quarter. Num game number two against Miami with 14. Game four against Miami with 20. And game one against Utah. And here's Jordan for three. Rebounded by Longley. Jordan gives it up. Pippen. Up. Jordan played by Stockton. We're just under three minutes remaining in the four. Pippen again with room for three. Yes! The three on two. Pippen steps back to shoot the three. That's just to give some extra right. advice. Well, the, the Jazz now 19 of 23 <laughs> at the line. Mike Shaminsky in the white shirt. The, he's the buffer right there. Yeah, Mike, the uh, Utah trainer. Passing on advice from the senator. The Jazz 98 and the Bulls 88. I have seen some great crossovers in my day. Tim Hardaway, Allen Iverson. But if this is not a carry, I don't know what is. Michael Jordan bearing down on Jeff Hornacek. Oh. <laughs> and look at Hornacek. Hornacek's yeah. face on the other side was, wait a second, how can you play defense yeah. if you're not going to call that? And, and Michael, believe me, doesn't even need that. But he wanted to make sure that he cleared a defender and got him to the lane. 10 seconds. And they're on their feet. Standing ovation for the Utah Jazz, who have been able to get back into the series with a solid performance as they defeat the Chicago Bulls, 104-93.